What was your relationship with alcohol like before the comeback? Uh, alcohol was my escape. Uh, my to-do list is 30 pages long, and I was always very anxious, and at the end of the day, I couldn't wind down. And so I, I turned to alcohol to help me slow down and get to sleep at night. And it, it was every once in a while, then it was every night, and then I looked forward to it more than just as a way to get through the night. So it was a problem. As far as like now, after the successfully completed comeback, what is your relationship with alcohol like today? Uh, non-existent. I, it doesn't bother me. I don't think about it. Um, are there times when I think I'd like to have something? I, I do, but I, I just choose not to. Um, before I didn't have the ability to make that choice. What are there, how does it affect other areas of life, family, business, or family work, kids, people you love? Uh, you Which know, it, in all areas of my life, I have clear goals now, um, and I don't, I'm not overwhelmed with anxiety. Uh, I'd say I have have a, a calm focus um, and, and I know which direction I'm going. And uh, I'm here today just to keep working on the plan. Uh, the plan needs to evolve as I get closer to the goals and to change the goals and keep moving forward. What do you think the biggest gift the comeback has given you, but ultimately Mike, you gave yourself? I'm getting my confidence back. Uh, I, I know I'm not where I need to be, but I'm, I'm definitely not where I was three months ago when we started. So that, just confidence, that's the big one for me. So, you put yourself back in the guy that was sitting there about to click on their Facebook ad. There's somebody out there thinking right now today, should or should I not do this? What would you tell your, yourself, what would you tell that guy? Uh, if, you're, if you're ready to make the change, then commit to it and go for it. If, if there's something in you that says, I, don't, I just wanna try it, uh, I'd say don't sign up. Uh, go all in, work the program. I know I didn't do every step along the way, um, but I, I did what I could and what I felt comfortable with and, and I'm better for it. So I, I think if I had just tried to, to look and see what it was instead of jumping in with both feet, I don't think I would have had the success I've had.